Good evening. Uh, welcome back to some more Animal Crossing. I feel like, uh, normally there's quite some time between Animal Crossing videos, but didn't I just do one? Like, not even that long ago. Definitely before I went to see Lady Gaga. What a wonderful concert that was. Uh, if you know me, I haven't shut up about it since it happened on Monday. It's been a good time. She was really tiny. Uh, through the camera lens. You know, I couldn't get like super good pictures or video, but it turned out great. I had a really good time. It wasn't about taking pictures of Lady Gaga to prove my was there. I saw her with my own eyeballs and that matters. It matters the most. Uh, so anyway, Freya, right before I left for the concert, Freya was like, I'm gonna move. And I was like, get out of here, go and get. Uh, she's been here for like a year or so. I don't know, when did I do Freya Quest? Whenever that happened, so. <laughs> uh, and I was like, well, uh, I kinda want another girl. Cherry's kind of cool. She's like a like a sisterly like Phoebe, I think. And they're both kind of like hardcore punk bitches. So wouldn't it be cool to have them both living very near my house? So so that's why we're gonna go looking for Cherry. I also just think she's kind of cool in general. So why don't we just get right into it right here? I hope you guys like the the big cherry I put in there. So that's what she looks like. Uh, a little less squished up though. Uh, I just fit it to the, the chat box. So that's why she's a little squishy looking. Um, so if you haven't uh, watched one of these before, I have 50 rock mile tickets. And I'm gonna go villager hunting. And if I find cherry, amazing. If I don't and I get to the 50th and I haven't had that villager on my island before, that's who's coming. Uh, if the 50th is somebody I have had before, then I'm gonna let a rando move in. So I'll have to time travel until someone fills the plot. Uh, last time I let a rando move in, uh, a rattle moved in, rattle. He was my rattle from my island originally, like in 2020. And then he moved to my friend's island and then he moved back to mine. And I was kind of mad he's like wasting a space basically because I don't need his photo. I'm not gonna gift him to get his photo. But you know, he's, he's grown on me again. I remember Rattled's real G. He's the best. I love him. So he's allowed to stay for a little while. But I kind of hope that he will decide to move out of his own volition pretty quickly. I feel like the ones that travel over from your, your friend's islands tend to not stick around too long, which is fine. Uh, but anyway, we're gonna, we're gonna hope we take Cherry home. I don't think I've even seen her in this game yet. There's quite a few, you know, we're gonna, we're gonna see Sasha. We're gonna see Raymond. It's gonna happen. I always say it's gonna happen and it doesn't, but I feel it this time. Something good's gotta happen to me. Uh, all right. So also, if you haven't watched this before, I'm so sorry. The airport, 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 airport. The airport is the most boring part and you're gonna see a lot of it. Honestly, watching the edited down version on YouTube is a much more pleasant experience I found revisiting my own videos. So without further ado, let's go. Let's do this. So I'm I'm not gonna like resource gather or shake trees for furniture or anything or try to, I mean, I guess if the DIY is sitting on the beach and it's like right there, then fine, I'll grab it because I'm always looking for recipes. But mostly we're just gonna see who it is, go ew or aw, and then we're gonna, we're gonna bounce. In fact, now I gotta put up my little counter. Number one. All right, so who is lucky number one? Oh, a dog. Oh, I think I've seen this one before. Uh, Portia? Cookie. Aw. So she sounds like a puppy. So a dog right out the gate. That's good luck. Not the one we need, but the sign. Yeah, if we start crawling up also like into the 30s, 40s, and 50, uh, I will probably stop talking to them, especially if they're one I've seen a bunch of times or they're just boring in general. Like, I never want to talk to a crocodile or a hippo. I'm sure there's a cute hippo out there. I just haven't met them yet. All right. Ooh, I already almost forgot to change the number. It's a bird. I think that's Jay or Jacob or something. You know what? I don't care enough to find out. Oh, yeah. I dressed kind of punk because, you know, Cherry's kind of punk, so but that'd be cool. I was so mad though, the black studded backpack, gold studs. Everything, all the other like visual punk and like leather stuff have silver, silver details. Yesterday I uh, binged the entire, oh, it's Rory. I binged the entire season two of Russian Doll. I've been meaning to watch that, so I thoroughly enjoyed. But you know, uh, the first time I watched, I don't know why I was gonna talk to them, I've talked to Rory. The first time I watched Russian Doll season one, like I binged the whole thing in one sitting, so I'm not surprised that happened to me again. Sorry, I have no interest in Rory. I really had him. I know he's a jock. He plays KK Fair in his house and it's so annoying. I hate jocks. I was talking about their stupid muscles. I have to stay hydrated. Okay, there is one cute thing about Rory and then his toe beans are like blue. Cute little toe beans. Who? Oh, it's one of the new ones. Oh my gosh, I literally covered my mouth in shock. 
Soliel. Maybe she's not one of the new ones. I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly, Soliel. No, I have seen her before. She lives on my friend's island or did. She's cute though, look at her. Oops. Let me let me do a ticket check. Yep. Really good accounting. I used I used to be able to do math. Took uh, calculus in high school. Don't ask me to do it now, but I did. And I hear you say, but crispy, counting isn't the same as calculus. I don't want to hear it. Math is math. The same in every language. All right, all right, all right. Is that is that is that Salil again? No. That's a different hamster. Clay. Thump. Wow, he's really cool looking, actually. Look at this guy. Oh, man. Uh, okay, I'm going to attempt to get him on first-person camera, but this never seems to work out in my favor. Oh, look, I have to, like, lean down. Look at him! Make him back. No, turn around. He's got, like, a necklace on. This guy is so cool. Sorry. Yas, work. Yas king. Yas. Yes. Okay, that's enough. I'm sorry. That was great. <laughs> yeah, we are. Wave squad represent. All right, who's it gonna be? I don't think anybody can be Clay. That guy was so cool. It's a duck. Which duck, though? There's so many I've never talked to. Weber? Weber? I'm gonna say Weber. That's webbed feet. Get it? Oh, that's cute. Oh, it's a bamboo island. Cool. All right, let's find out who it is. Come on, Cherry. Wow. Wow. <gasps> He's got a crazy face. Crazy face. All right, let's put this guy in first person because I got to see this. Benjamin. I wonder, there's, who, oh, did you see red toe beans? Oh, look at those eyebrows. That is the most. Yes. He closed his eyes. Work, Benjamin. Yeah. Oh, I didn't even tell him to turn his head. Okay. That's two dogs. We saw two dogs now. So, like, this, this is going to be good. Man, you know, I, I thought I've seen every possible villager in this game. N not just in my own game, but, I mean, just in general from all the content out there. But I'm getting surprised continuously. I've never seen Clay before. I've never seen Benjamin before. Like, we're, we're gonna see some crazy ones. I think last time I saw one that looks like freaking Donkey Kong straight up. I think we're gonna see Cherry. I don't know when. Maybe be on number 50. But we're gonna see her. Oh, it's Fauna! Oh wait, it could also be Diane. I always get the two confused. Oh, the dots on the back of her head. It's Fauna. Man, Azalea moved to my island like a month ago, and I like never see her. More importantly, I never see her in her house. And that makes me mad because I, I've been giving her items to decorate her house. And I still don't know what it looks like on the inside. Yeah, yeah, I could look it up on the on the wiki, but what's it look like with the stuff I gave her? Mm. Wish I could play this game in VR. That'd be so fun. I wonder if future iterations will have like a 360 view. Another deer. Deidre. Deirdre. What abs? Oh, she's another peppy deer. I have a peppy deer. Her name is Shino. And she still hasn't, hasn't given me her photo. It's pissing me off so much. <laughs> Peppies are the worst. They just like hold out on you. Like, I don't want to be your best friend. I just want your stupid picture. Like, you know, if you ask for their, like, autograph, they'll just give you an autographed photo. Come on. That girl has some thick lipstick. I don't know if you saw that. Oh, man, they're gonna make me climb for this one. Wait, is that a bird? It's that robot bird again. Forgot his name, but not worth it. Yeah, yeah, I know we just spent gallons and gallons of gas landing this thing, but I'm gonna need you to take off again. Whoa, very pink. Oh, it's fuchsia. That makes sense. Staring at that gorgeous horizon. Nice. This airport is purgatory. That is an elephant. That is dizzy. No, it's Axel. Wait, didn't I have Axel on my island? Hmm. I had a jock elephant. And when, when you left his house, he waved with both paws, and I thought that was the cutest shit. I need to know. Did I have Axel on my island? 
Yeah, I guess I did. <laughs> I totally forgot. Oh, he was a cutie. A jock, though. That's the worst part. Up there? Is that a cow? Yeah. Not worth it. What the heck is Zydeco? Why do they keep making me climb? I keep hearing that if you don't put a, a vaulting pole or a ladder in your inventory, they won't give you islands that require that, but I don't want to find out the hard way that's- <gasps> It's dumb! Yeah, last summer. Indeed a -roo. Aw, okay, he's the only jock that I like. He's so cute. Alright, see you later. You're not cherry. Get out of my face. So yeah, anyway, I don't want to ditch that and then find out the hard way that I did actually need both of those things. Or maybe I should test that theory before I record these. That's the thing, though. I don't think about it until I'm already in the middle. It'd be cool if your, your villagers could, like, go on vacation and leave the island. I mean, they technically can through the Happy Home Paradise DLC, but they aren't, like, actively gone, gone from your island. Whoa. Crazy-looking alligator. Well, no need to talk to him. It's a bird. Nope. What an interesting layout. I'm so- like, this seems like an island I've never been to. I- legit. What? Whoa! What's up with your face? You look like Chuck E. Cheese. What is going on with the hair? Moose? You're a mouse named Moose? Oh, it's another jock. Oh my, what? Okay, I gotta, I gotta get a close-up on this hair. What the heck? All these mice have weird hair. Like, I saw one that had, ooh, pretty sunset. I saw one that had, uh, he walked behind there. Like, his, his mustache was his hair tied under his nose? That was odd. Alright, get over here. Alright, forget it. I've already spent too long caring about this guy. Like, his hair is on his ears, too? I- What the heck? Oh, it's a kangaroo. Eh. The fact that their little Joey doesn't talk and just emulates their expressions kind of freaks me out. Oh, is that a penguin? I bet his name is Admiral. That sounds right. I'm gonna go talk to him. Where are you? What? Oh. Boomer? Okay, Boomer. <laughs> human? Did he say human? I closed that too quickly and I don't want to talk to him again. Okay, Boomer. <laughs> Hold on, I'm looking up Boomer's catchphrase. It is human. It is human. That's weird. That's so weird. I don't like that. Bye. No hippos. Coming up to the halfway point. No cherry yet. The monkey. Uh, I've seen that one before. Or maybe not and they all look the same. I don't know, but that's fine. I get animals mixed up all the time. Especially when I only look at them from a distance. A lady hippo. Sorry. Another kangaroo? Yeah, but a boy. Huh, interesting. I don't think I've seen one without without a joey. They really should have made it so you could hop from island to island without coming back to the airport. I've probably said every possible thing about this thing at this airport I've wanted to say. Oh, it's Anna Annabelle. I've had her. My favorite thing about her is that she would do yoga in her yard all the time. Even when I moved her house and changed her yard up, she was still specifically in her yard area doing yoga. It was great. That was super cute. All right, halfway point. Let's see, let's see, who's it gonna be? Wow, that's one heck of a goat. Grop. I feel like I might have seen him during, uh, Nan class. Sorry, I wasn't even paying attention when he said They all say the same crap. He must have been a grump. He said something about trying to figure it all out or whatever. Yeah, basically. Stay out of my swamp. Stay off of my nook island. Oh my god, I'm gonna talk about Lady Gaga for a second. At the concert... She did, uh, she started with Bad Romance and it was great. Oh my god. But she did, like, Poker Face and she really did pu 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 fucker Face and I was so happy. She really does sing it like that. 
Like, it was very obvious. You could hear her pretty well. Oh. Whoa. Oh yeah, Jacob. I think I've run across him before and I was like, what a normal name. But then I realized, like, J is short for Jacob. It's still a bird pun. Oh my gosh, the Gaga show was so good. I literally, my fingers literally went numb. I thought I was gonna pass out at the beginning. Like, the, the build-up hype to her actually, like, coming out on the stage was unreal. And the where I was sitting, I couldn't even see her physically for the first three songs because the stage was so massive and built into itself that she was, like, hiding away. So when I, like, actually saw her during the third song or fourth song, I was like, oh my god! Another kangaroo! That one looks straight evil. I gotta know. Matilda. I'm pretty sure it's Matilda. That name is too nice for something that looks so evil. Maybe there's some context I'm missing. I'm mostly legit surprised I didn't scream myself hoarse. Because I was like singing really loud. I'm, I'm assuming really loud. I couldn't hear myself over the speaker. Holy crap, another kangaroo! Okay, I have to talk to this one. Sylvia. Oh, pineapple dress. That's cute. Boing. At first I thought it said bong, and then I thought it said boring, before my brain was finally like, no, it says boing, you idiot. <laughs> What's yours, bong? <laughs> yeah, the Joey's, like, freak me out. Oh, you know what's really cool? Okay, I'm gonna talk about Lady Gaga again. <laughs> I'll just warn you every time. I've seen on concert videos from other shows this huge circular piano that they have. She, not her playing, with someone in the, in the actual band. And I actually saw that piano, and it was so freaking cool to see that IRL. Man, just little things. All the graphics remind me of, like, Bayonetta and Destiny 2 and Metal Gear Solid. A wolf. Cute. Next time I, I go to a Lady Gaga show, if that's feasible in the future, I'm absolutely gonna shell out for, like, front row or, you know, general admission or something. I don't care. Like, it was awesome, like, being in the same stadium as her, but, like, I couldn't like, see her with all of her detail, you know. I could see there is a person with blonde hair dancing on the stage, but I can't see their face or their mouth moving. But I got to sing along with Lady Gaga. That was so cool. Like, she doesn't know we sang together, but I do. Uh, she sang, like, a pseudo unreleased verse for A Thousand Doves. That was super cool. I don't remember what they were at all, but I was shocked. I was like, oh my god. Secret lyrics. Uh-oh, I'm not gonna shut up about Lady Gaga. If Lady Gaga was a villager, that I'd be going on a Gaga quest. <laughs> oh yeah. Everybody loves the pink squirrels. Okay, well, I don't love pink squirrels enough to talk to them. Oh my gosh, it's this gross guy. Alright, bye. Low luck lately. That's a lot of L's. Just adding to the pile of L's, I suppose. <laughs> I am drinking a... Uh, Black Cherry Seltzer, I just realized it's uh, completely coincidental that was just the one that was cold in the fridge. So maybe, maybe Polar. Polar will give me all the energy. I'm drinking Polar Seltzer. Look, I'm really reaching here. I'm trying to keep the faith. Another a rhino. I've seen this guy before. He's got a leaf on the back of his head. Man! Rude, rude, rude. My luck is so low, I'm gonna end up with a jock last. Come on, Cherry, where are you at? Oh, it's that bear. He looks like he hangs out in the woods. I bet that bear shits in the woods. I mean, if they started using toilets, we'd all be in trouble. I'm gonna assume you spend a lot of time in the woods, cutie. Oh my gosh, I just realized it's cutie bear. Man, you know, okay, you gotta forgive me, I'm still on puns. That's so stupid, because I like puns, and then my friends will say, like, funny shit in the chat, and I'm just saying, they're like, duh, I don't get it. That's me being dumb. Reading comprehension? Low. Pun comprehension? Lower. It's just all low for me. Becky with the good hair? <laughs> yeah, well, the, okay, being the, the being sick isn't affecting my, my brain. Well, maybe it is, but I feel uh, as normally dumb as I know. Yeah. Yep, I said that. I'm really making the case for my gut and myself, you guys. Y'all got me flustered. Yeah, Becky with a good beak. She gives good beak. I'll show myself out. Stream ends. Uh, ketchup is somebody who's having my island. I'm not gonna read that. Log bed. What a tear- You know what? It's not even worth keeping. Out of here. No. No cows. No bull. Not after rodeo. They ask you how you are. Instead of boo, I say moo. 
Oh, it's Melba. I used to have her on my island and I got rid of her prematurely because I wanted Nan so bad. Sorry, Melba. All right, see ya. She is a cutie. I'll, I'll invite her back someday because I want to get her photo, obviously. There, there's a really cool guy koala. What is his name? He wears uh, like a bomber jacket and sunglasses and he looks so cool. It's bumming me out, I forgot his name. Eugene. His name is Eugene. He's cool as heck. I don't think I can name any of the others. Eugene and Melba. Canberra? Canberra? I don't know how to pronounce that. Oh, that's my problem. Like, I can read. Just sometimes there's words you've never heard out loud, so you just kind of guess how they're pronounced. And yeah, I know Google can help, but like, you're gonna pull out your phone every single time you see a word in passing you don't know how to pronounce. I'm lazy, okay? Who is up here? No one important. A duck. Nah. Alligator? Nope. I'm starting to feel the crunch. I think that's Eloise. Goodbye. Where are they? Come out, come out, wherever you are. Okay. Where are they? Nibbles. Aw. I already know that one. But for real, okay, where the heck is this villager? Oh, here they are. Oh, wow. Chief. I think I've seen you around before. I got really into this channel that did, um, no commentary Minecraft long plays. And it, like, I would only watch it before I fell asleep. And it was, like, a 13-hour video. So it took me months to get through it. And it was just, like, building a farm real casual and in peaceful mode. But I loved every second of it. So chill. Aw, tiger. Yeah, we're- I'm probably not gonna talk to any of them anymore. Unless they look crazy. I mean, that's how I found Chops and Olaf. Well, I never saw Chops again after that one time. But I found out the hard way that having three smugs on your island at the same time is not all that fun. And if I had to pick one, it had to be Olaf to go because he was like the gross bachelor version of the, the other two, Klaus and, and Marshall. Marshall is such a sweet baby. Sweet baby Marshall. I hope he lives on my island forever. I know his dialogue is literally the exact same as all the other smugs, but something about Marshall saying it. It's special in the way that Julian was special. Julian is sweet baby as well. But he was the one who moved and I got Freya. So everything works the way it works for a reason. And 42 is the answer to everything. Maybe it's the answer to our cherry question. Oh no, it's this lion. Elvis? He's got a scar on his face? Okay. He was cool. Oh, yeah, so much for- I'm not getting attacked any more of them. It's funny that a lot of the lions are so academic, and then the rest are just like jocks. Is that another bird? I think so. I'm just standing here like they're gonna turn on. Yeah, it is a bird. I've seen him before. A horse. Of course. Of course. I bet his name's like Elmer. Oh yeah, place your bets. Place your bets. You don't win anything, but the satisfaction of knowing you were correct. I'm gonna say 45. And then I'll say 46. And then I'll say 47. Oh, oh my gosh, it's that, it's that same goat. Uh, Grub? I've already forgotten. And then he comes back here. No. It is Grub. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Project table. <gasps> A new thingy! What's it look like? That's really boring but cute. It takes 10 wood. Oh, it comes in three colors. I think that's the first repeat. So, no repeats up until the 45th. Not the kangaroos, though. A chicken. Hmm. See if I can see them from here. No, of course not. Gotta climb. Wait. It's Apple! It's a Okay, we gotta talk to Apple. Sorry, I'm just prolonging this. <laughs> aw, 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 it's so cute! It must be me. It is me! Whoa! I'm sorry, who are you? Oh man, it'd be funny to have Apple and Cherry on the island. It'd be funny if there were enough food named ones. I don't think there are. Well, there's um... Oh my gosh, there's there's Chatter. This name's kind of a food pun. I mean, it is a food pun. That would be so hard to get specific villagers. Oh yeah, Meringue. You're right. There probably are just enough food ones. I mean, you're not gonna get like all fruit or all vegetable or whatever. Does ketchup count? So there's a theme for somebody, Food Themed Island. 
Master Chef the Island. Not me though. Uh, you know, ever since I did that huge revamp earlier this year, I just I can't deal. I haven't bothered like trying to do anything. I don't even change the bushes or the flowers or the color themes. I'm just like, forget it. Once fall rolls around though, and I can put like leaf piles down and stuff. Oh, it's over. I'm gonna decorate the crap out of my island for fall and, and Halloween. Come on, Sherry. It's another mouse. They all look so crazy. They all have crazy hair. Fine, I'll talk to you just so I can see your face. Greta. I think that's a cheese pun. Like a cheese Greta. Cheese grater. She says she's down to dish. <laughs> oh, that's good. That was a real belly rocker. <laughs> oh man, it's feeling real. We might get stuck. Maybe, we, maybe we'll pull it out right at the last second. We will not pull it out at the last second. That's a cow. This game is so rude to me. That's the last trip. Fingers crossed, toes crossed. Give me all your crystal power, your astrology, your juju. I'm really surprised I only got one repeat on this island. All right, guys, so we gotta climb to find our fate for this one. All right, let's do it. Who is it? Who is it? I don't think it's Cherry. Oh, no! Oh, goodness. Oh, oh no. Oh my gosh. Who are you? Oh, it's Cube. Your eyes are terrifying. Brain freeze? Now, okay, let me remember. Cube is named Cube because, duh, Ice Cube pun. But also, he premiered on the GameCube. And he had a GameCube shirt. Uh, you know what? I'll survive. I'll survive. I just, I have to come up with a yard for this weirdo. It'll probably be like frozen items. I'll just lean real hard into the penguin theme. Come on, you little weirdy. Alright, well, first things first. Second, I can, I can give him gifts. He's getting outfit changes. Alright, well, Cube. Cube is the newest resident of Breezy Bay. It's, uh... Creepy eyes that are like a mix between like a screw and and uh, Kermit the Frog. Not creepy at all. Not one bit. And for one last time, we're gonna fly back to the airport. Let's go see some fireworks. How about it? All right, we will not be returning to the desk. We'll be leaving this purgatory. All right, so if I'm correct, there should be fireworks going off. Yay! Okay. Anyway, I wanted to run up this way. I could have used the warp pipe, I guess. To show you where uh, Cube's new home is going to be. Obviously, the previous tenant uh, had a, a cuter aesthetic. Nope, it's limited to my sanity, and I'll tell you why. Because the very first quest I ever did was called Man Quest, and you won't find it on my YouTube. Because my stupid ass decided 150 tickets was a good number. It took me 8 hours across 2 streams, and I found her on the 148th ticket. And let me tell you, it takes long enough just to edit these ones. These regular two hour long ones. Though you can imagine why that one's not hitting YouTube. So yeah, I drove myself insane and went crazy. So I that's why I picked 50. 50 is totally doable. So this keeps you home. Uh, I'll figure out what to do with this yard some other time. So up here it's going to be Cube, me, Crispo. I don't know why I keep him. I should get rid of him. And Freya and Azalea. Oh. Alright, let's go watch some fireworks. Up in my star stargazing pond. I guess there's not even a pond up there. Alright, here we are, finally. Let's sit down, huh? Oh, you have to pull out the camera before you sit down. Isn't that nice? They seem kind of low on the horizon, though. Maybe they're somewhere with a better view. Oh, I forgot I had the camera on. <laughs> I was like, why am I going away? Goodness gracious. Cute. I think I have some patterns. I'm just waiting for them to show up. This should be like a sonic one. And some swirls. So where's my streak so far? I found Freya. That's one. Didn't find Chops. 
Didn't find shops again. Oh, there's Sonic. There's Lady Gaga. There we go. Some flowers that didn't show up very well. Uh, I found Olaf. I didn't find Cherry, so I guess like half and half. I'll count Chops as one. So I guess the next one we'll see. Some really cool ones at the beginning, but by the end it was just really boring. Sorry about that, you guys. I get the feeling uh, Cube is a, a lazy... In fact, I'm going to look him up right now. Cube is a lazy penguin with the play hobby, so he's basically Bricolo. Oh, he's got like the pastel wooden block furniture. I don't know how I feel about that. Well, eventually I'll actually sit there and play uh, Happy Home Paradise to the point where I can edit my own villagers' houses. I've been meaning to do that for Freya. Uh, not Freya. Phoebe. Alright, well, this is a good place to stop. They are kind of mesmerizing though, aren't they? And the music's super calm. Thanks for tuning in. Uh, until next time.